Hi everybody, I'm Maheen and this is your Saturday stretch for the Daily Belly Dance Quickies. A lot of us use the head rolls, sometimes as a warm-up or maybe as a stretch afterwards, or maybe you even just do them during the day at work while you're sitting there way too long at your computer. But there's a safe way to do them and there's some not so safe things that you can do with these as well. So I want to take a few minutes today to talk about doing head rolls safely. So a head roll, basically you're making a circle with your neck and your head describing the circle. So you can take your chin down to your chest, keeping the shoulders down, taking it to the side, taking your ear towards your shoulder. Now here's the part where people can get in some trouble. When you're here, and I'm going to turn sideways so you can see a little better, when you take your head backwards, you don't want to let the whole weight of your neck let your head fall back like this. This is what you don't want to do. You want to keep this space in here a little bit open. So think about looking up to the ceiling. Think about extending the front of the neck, but don't let the weight of the head drop backwards. This is the important thing. And we're going to come back through that point over to the side. So again, I'm ear to shoulder position, and then I'm coming back down here. Now, these things are what are generally safe recommendations for someone who doesn't have any neck injuries, any bulging discs, any kind of degeneration in their discs, and all kind of any other things that may have happened to your neck, hopefully not you. So, if you have neck injuries, or if you have problems or pain, or you hear crunching, well, crunching may or may not be a bad thing. A crunching accompanied by pain, probably something you should get checked out. So you don't want to hear a lot of crunching, and most of the time the crunching that you hear is this back portion of it. The big thing is not to let the weight of your head fall back. Think more about looking up. You can get all of the benefits of a neck stretch, especially with the side, by making your circles not include this far back in safely. Share it with a friend. If you're a teacher, please make sure you're using good technique in your class regarding head rolls as warm-ups or cool-downs. And I will see you next time with more stretches and strength in the Saturday edition of the Daily Belly Dance Quickies. Check it out in the box down there. And have a good week. Thanks.